Hi guys, so this is my Poison Ivy tutorial for the huge um, beauty YouTubers collaboration for the release of Man of Steel, um, Man of Steel rather. We all decided that we were going to do um, like just a superhero or villain look. I decided on Poison Ivy, there's sort of like a green tinge to my skin and um, the red hair and eyebrows, obviously the red lips because I don't see Poison Ivy without red lips and red hair in my head, that's just what she looks like. Um, I didn't want to go for full green skin which is why I just did like the hints of it around key areas so you could see it. Um, there is a little bit on my neck as well but I don't think it's really shown up that well. Um, to do my hair all I did is put eyeshadow on it, literally I spent ages rubbing it in. Um, but yeah, I will pop the link to the Beauty YouTubers Unite Facebook group and the links of, well, all the girls that are doing it, I think. I think there's a huge thing that I have to copy and paste into the description so you can find everyone. But if you want to know how I did this Poison Ivy look, please, please, <laughs> stay tuned. Um, it's really fun and doesn't really come together until the end. Um, but yeah, that's that and please go and watch everybody else's videos. Um, I'll be putting this as a video response to Katz because she started the group um, and everything you'll need to know will be in the doobly-doo below. See you soon. So the poison out of it, all I've done is put some red in my hair and literally I've just taken red eyeshadow and popped it in places. Um, I've not done it all over because that would take hours, but just because I think Poison Ivy should have red hair. But I am going to see if I can make my eyebrows more red. Now I'm terrible at covering my eyebrows, so I'm just going to see if I can make them a little bit more red. So I'm just taking a red eyeshadow from my 120 palette and I'm going to fill them in. Then apply a taupey brown base colour all over the base of the eye. And now at this point I'm going to put my foundation on but not my concealer. So I'm just going to use the Revlon Colour Stay and this is in the shade Ivory. Take a darker brown and start building up on the lid of your eye.
take an even darker brown and put it in the outer corner of the eye. Then start blending. I'm going to run an eyeliner underneath the lower lash line. This is a dark brown. This is um, number 11 by Rimmel. Use another darker brown and do a line at the top lashes and start to cat eye it out. Then I'm going to apply a black on the waterline. I'm going to take a gold and pop that in the inner corners. Green colour and pop that in the crease. Time to contour. I'm going to use a few different contours on my face. I'm going to use Hoola on my cheeks. green and pop it around the temples. I'm literally just putting this on a really big brush and letting it drop wherever it falls. It's going to sort of hit all of those bones that stick out, so my cheekbones and stuff. And in my 120 palette, I'm taking it from here, but I'm not really being too precise, so I'm picking up a bit of the purple and a bit of the white with it as well. Bright pink blush. So I'm going to add this sleek one, which is in pixie pink. I just want to get that on the cheekbones.
into the lips. I'm going to line them with a red lip liner. And then fill it in with a really bright red lipstick. I'm going to use this Diego Del Palma one and this is in Rosetta Rosa. 